and I oh hi hey guys what's up with me welcome back to my channel if you don't know me it's because I haven't been on my channel in a hot second but guess what beaches it's summer break and guess what that means a lot of YouTube videos coming from your girl because I've been the today. So I wanted to do this. is like a weird video. It's kind of like it's a little quirky and crazy, you know. I'm really I'm a relatable teen, and I can't wait to share you this video. If you read the title of this video and you clicked on it, thank you for clicking on it. I appreciate you so much. You're such a peach. This video is basically a reading vlog. What's a reading vlog, you may be asking? And that's because you don't watch booktubers. I'm not a booktuber in any means, shape, form, nothing. I don't. I do book reviews all the time. But booktubers are basically YouTubers that talk a lot about books. They do book reviews. They do book content stuff. And it's actually a pretty big community. And I discovered them not maybe too long ago, a couple months ago. Uh, first person I've ever checked out was Jesse the Reader. And he is so freaking funny. I really, really like him and his personality I just I vibe with. So I was watching a lot of him and then I started reaching out to like other booktubers and I was like, wow, these people are cool. And I actually really like their recommendations. So, they so yeah, I decided I would do a reading vlog because I've been getting so much into reading. Uh, and so today, since I've been reading the Shatter Me series, I'm on book four, which is what I'm reading today uh, for this vlog. So the book four is called Restore Me by... I probably should have figured out how to say her name before I started. Tara... Him I don't know how to say it. I'm so sorry. Um, but I've been really, really loving the Shatter Me series recently. Let's go read. Okay, hey, so, um, it's actually been a couple hours, and I said I was probably going to read maybe tomorrow, but I got done, and I'm kind of feeling like reading right now. Uh, it's currently 323. I just got done working out. As you can see, I'm in, like, some workout clothes. I'm, like, a little sweaty. Um, my arms really hurt because today is arm day, so, yeah. But I'm about to go read this book right now. I'm thinking about going outside because it's such a pretty day outside. It looks so pretty, and I might put on a swimsuit and, like, tan a little bit. I love how I said I was gonna go tan, but girl, I don't tan, I burn. <laughs> and also, the cutest little thing, my coach got us Sonic after workouts. Love her the most, so probably gonna bring that out there too. So we're gonna go read outside. I Hopefully I won't fall asleep in the sun. I'm gonna change into a swimsuit and like kind of tan-ish. later it's like it's almost 10 30 uh so it's been a bit since i talked to you last at like four i think uh so i was reading restore me and then i got really freaking hot and so i decided to go back inside also i've never looked better here are my thoughts so far i'm on page 101 so let me talk to you a little bit about my thoughts so far this book i so it's hard for me to get into this one so far, which is really weird because the other Shatter Me books that I've read, I literally read Shatter Me in a day, like one day. This one's getting like, this one's harder for me to get into because of the different perspectives that it has and doesn't flow like the other one, the other uh, three did. And the other three, it just works on Juliet's perspective and that's it. Like it's just her perspective. Uh, and it flows pretty well going from a chapter to a chapter and the chapters are very very short which I actually really like how they're short because it helps me get through it really fast. Um, however this one has different perspectives. It has Juliet's and Warner's perspective in this so uh, it's I don't know I don't maybe it's just me but I don't really like different perspectives. I'd rather just focus on one character one perspective know how they're feeling know what's in their head because I like to be them like pretend like I am them you know. Um, and having two characters to work on and like see their point of views it is interesting to see what how other characters are feeling but I don't know it messes my head up and I can't ever get through something I don't know that's probably just me also I love how it said like there's no chapter titles and the chapters are actually pretty they're longer than they have been so like it'll have 
Juliet right here. And then Warner's is really cool. His are like a little smoky. I don't really know why. It's kind of cool. See, his, is, his has like smoke or something, like little brown parts right here. So, uh, they look like frayed or like he's in the clouds. I don't really know. It's kind of cool. So that's Warner's perspective. So yeah, I'm going to read a little bit more tonight. I will probably, obviously, update you guys tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow. I have updated you guys on reading. I, uh, yeah, I've been reading for a little bit off camera and I am on page 275. I'm on Warner's part right now. And some major tea. Tea has been spilt, y'all. Tea has been spilled. Like, it's crazy right now. So, um, uh, I'm in like the crazy part. For some reason, I am taking so long to finish this book i usually fly by these books like i'm pretty like i want to know what happens i don't know why and like there's like it's like it's very interesting there's a lot of good stuff there's some filler chapters in here that i'm like that never really happened in the other books but i don't know why this one is just taking me so much longer to finish i don't know why i usually like i said i fly by these pretty fast also what i did today is i took some instagram pictures i don't know if i'm gonna post any of them because i did this in front of like my garage and i don't know if i really like any of them honestly so i'm probably gonna edit those pictures and then after i edit them i'm going to pick this book back up and kind of read because it's it's intense right now i'm kind of like not wanting to read this part because I'm a little sad what happened. I'll be right back. Uh, if I read Restore Me, if I finish it, I'll let you know how it goes and how I'm feeling. So yeah. next day i it is what time is it 2 30 um i didn't it didn't take me that long to finish this book i actually finished this last night last night i finished this last night a lot of new information that happened and i was like what so i was a little confused i mean i'm not confused i mean i'm kind of i'm like curious i want to know what happens next so yeah this book i would give it probably out of five stars mm. Maybe like a four, four star, maybe 3.5 to four star. Uh, I only say that because of the things that I've mentioned before. Um, I'm not a huge fan of different perspectives, which I think is interesting. I like to know how everyone's feeling and da 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 But I just, I don't know. It's like, it's, it's interesting to think of like oh, how others are thinking, but I'm not a huge fan of that. I just rather have f focus on like one character and see how it goes from there also like the content some some of the chapters were just kind of filler chapters and that hasn't really been happening in her other books where they just it takes a while for them to get there look, i love this cover this cover is gorgeous let's just look at it it's so freaking pretty and yeah so that is it thank you guys so much for watching i hope this was kind of interesting if it's not i probably won't do anything else if i start editing this and i don't like it i'm probably not gonna post it yeah so yeah thank you guys so much for watching make sure you give this video a big old thumbs up if i should do more reading vlogs if i shouldn't give it a thumbs up anyways i just i don't know love you guys so much don't forget to let the adventure begin and i'll see you guys next time Bye bye Some